right, hello and welcome to the Floby Part 2, or the Floby Mach 2. So uh, I started this a, a long time ago, like over 10 years ago, I'm not even exactly sure when. I don't quite have as much hair as I did when I made my first model, but I always wanted to make a, uh, a more permanent plastic version of the cardboard Floby, and uh, this is it. So I had to remake my cardboard version just to give myself a simpler template to work with. <laughs> Kirkland brand Floby. And used the same little chunk of plastic pipe from before. And this is just clear acrylic that's cut and super glued to itself so that it sits neatly on top of my clippers. So the vacuum connects right there and then the suction is focused right here near the blade. Um, it's a bit loud having the vacuum. If you've tried using one of those um, like crevice tools, it kind of focuses the noise and does that as well. But the whole point of this thing is to put on whatever attachment you, you want. And then this makes sure that the hair is all pulled straight to so get a more precise cut. And you also don't get hair all over the place because it sucks it up into the vacuum. I'm also using this sort of dust collector thing, which is, uh, there's another video for that if you want to see how this was made, but this is basically a way of uh, keeping the hair from filling up the vacuum bag all the time. All the hair and dust and whatever else gets trapped in the bucket. And then I could run for absolute ages off of a single vacuum bag in my shop vac. Kind of a neat thing. First off, I'll demonstrate what you can get with sort of one of these angled bits, which is, you know, for cutting uh, around the ears or maybe across the back of the neck or something like that. Um, but I'm not going for fancy. Uh, these days, I go for short. So I've got a one inch for the beard, and this is, I guess, a quarter inch, which is for everything else. It doesn't really matter that this isn't an absolutely perfect fit because I'm still going to fasten it with a little bit of masking tape, which seals up the gaps. So there we, whoops. And that is more like it. 